If your office is anything like ours, there's been a cough bouncing around from person to person and no one seems to be getting any better. Samantha Sonner is the latest victim of the cough here at SMN. So what's going on? <coughs> Sound familiar? Oh, that's exactly the cough. I've got bad news. We have a fun name for it. We call it the 90-day cough. And that <laughs> cough is flooding doctor's offices. An upper respiratory illness. I don't know that I can call it an infection of bronchitis uh, or most likely viral, but it has been affecting people pretty badly. It comes on very quickly and makes people very sick. Dr. Joaquin Arizdemunio <coughs> says the cough could last weeks. <laughs> Inhalers, steroids, and antibiotics have all been prescribed, but nothing seems to be working. Nothing, nothing we have tried so far has helped. Uh, whatever we do, it just seems that time is the treatment of choice at this point. That doesn't mean you shouldn't see your doctor. Treatment is probably better earlier than later. Um, because we could probably try and prevent some of the swelling that occurs in the respiratory uh, tree from the infection of whatever it might be causing it. So definitely earlier than later is better. And there are signs the end is near. You know you'll get better when you stop coughing only when you change positions, i.e. when you're standing and you go to lay down, you'll cough, or when you're laying down and you stand, you cough, and then you know you're, you're about two weeks left over. So since my cough <laughs> has lasted about seven days. Got a ways to go. Patience is the best thing right now for this cough. Reporting in Sarasota, I'm Samantha Sonner, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. And if you have the cough, you could help prevent spreading it by washing your hands frequently and coughing in the crux of your arm.